Yes. That was good, that one, wasn't it? <laughs> Wonderful talent. Uh, great kid. Um, been brought up well. And his family and Dundee United looked after him. He's, he's, he's got a great way about him. Um, and I think he has a good future. Um, and I think he can play in more positions than people think. I think he's clever enough to go into positions. And he needs to add a couple of goals, I would imagine. I think that's what his manager's probably sent to him. Um, but good about the place. Um, as I said, I think he can play in a few positions. He's got a electric pace. Um, maybe one thing, one or two things make it work in his upper body strength. That, but I think that's a Scottish thing anyway. I think a lot smaller players have to work more on that. But I think he's he's been great in the squad, and um, we enjoy having him there. It's just a pity he's not had as many chances. But he plays in a position where we're, we're actually quite strong in that area. Um, I, I'm looking forward to it. I, um, like I did when I was a fan, I enjoyed it when I went there and I enjoyed it as a player and I hope to enjoy it as a manager. Um, but what I'm, what I'm looking for is the players to enjoy it and the fans to enjoy it. And uh, I said if we get the same enjoyment I got as a, as a player and as a fan then that would be great. Listen, there's, there's room for everybody um, because we're, you know, We've not got the, the greatest amount of players to pick from, that's for sure. And they too have already proved themselves on the international level. All they need to do is get fit. If they can get as fit as they were three, four years ago, then you don't lose your talent. You only lose your fitness. And I've spoke to the, both the players and they know fine well that uh, if they get their fitness back, then they will be, you know, they have a great chance of getting back in the squad. I think we've got to try... Uh, First of all, you get the ball, that'll be great. Um, but we will uh, we'll have to try and treat this more like a home game than an away game, I think, because we have to start the experiment now um, how to deal with players, uh, deal, deal with teams when they come to Hamden. You know, the formation in Croatia, uh, we have time to work on that. So we know that that works when the players play as well as they did, the formation works, because don't, formations don't work unless the players are playing well. So the players play well, we know that we've got that now, we can. I can chuck away and say that works. What we need to do now is, is what do we do at home? You know, what, how do we break teams down? So, I, I, and I think that uh, the England game would, there's a part of it got, we've got to use it for that. Well, they can still play, um, and uh, he's learning more about the game as he gets older, uh, Kenny. Um, so, uh, but he's also, he's, um, I, I think if you, if you ask me how international players should behave and train, I think if you look at Gary Cole and Kenny Muller, you know, and Steve McManus when he was there, and you've got Naismith, there's, there's people who, when the new people come to the, 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 the squad and say, well, they set an example, how you deal with the whole thing on and off the pitch. Um, so. He's picked for obviously his ability as a player, but um, the fact is, he's a terrific professional. Is, is, is great for us. I would like, if it comes to the benefit of grassroots football, um, that would do me the money going directly back to grassroots football. Um, I think that the players would enjoy it. I think the fans would enjoy it as well, and I know the coaches would. That's for sure. And I think if. if other, as I say, the grassroots football could benefit, then that would be great. He'll be in the under 21s. We've really start, and I think Tony Watt will be there as well. Uh, Shoot Armstrong, so he'll be uh, involved in the under 21s, that's for sure. Because Billy wants to win his game against England as well. They'll be playing at Sheffield the night before, that's for sure.